Beloved in Christ, our insight today in understanding of the Father's heart comes from Ephesians uh, 5 and 11. And I, Paul writes, brethren, if I yet preach circumcision, why do I yet suffer persecution? Then is the offense of the cross ceased. Paul was establishing that there is offense in the cross. There is rejection in the cross. There are those who will simplify the workings of of the cross. And the reason for that, beloved, is because we're living then and in our times now in fulfilling a watered down gospel. A gospel that tries to get people to believe that there is something other than the cross itself in order to bring a salvation. You see, the gospel of Christ demands change. And if the gospel you're hearing today is a gospel about meeting your needs, a gospel about prosperity only, beloved, it has become a watered down gospel. Just as the gospel then spoke about uh, circumcision being the way to become godly before God. And beloved, that gospel was watered down. And today, the same thing is very uh, prevalent. There are requirements by the watered down gospel. It says you must be in attendance, you must be this kind of giver, and that is what is established that you have a relationship with the Lord. Prosperity means everything. It means that you have a relationship with the Lord, but that is not true. There are many that are in poverty, but yet God is the head of their life. Beloved, we have to desire the meat of the word. We have to desire the sincere milk of the word. That we be not led astray by the gospel of inclusion and the gospel today that has been watered down. Beloved in Christ, seek the ways of the Lord and lean not upon your own understanding. And may the Father open your heart to His understanding in the name of Yeshua, Jesus the Christ.